Hey there, it's Lenny McGill with the Glock Store Performance and Custom Shop. Got my custom Glock Team Glock T-shirt on today. <laughs> Got something to show you. These are amazing. I mean, every once in a while, you know, I'm just like blown away by the work we do. And today is one of those days. I've got a, a triplet series here of three guns made identical for an amazing customer, a very special guy, uh, who wanted to um, uh, reward his wife for being a very special woman. So congratulations to him and congratulations to her because she's got one of these and two of uh, her friends have the other ones. But let me show you what these are. These are Glock 19 Gen 3s that have been totally decked out. And when I say decked out, everything's been redone. Now remember, these started off as plain black Glocks. And now they are unique, one of a kind, well, three of a kind, <laughs> uh, uh, handguns that are pretty darn amazing for a lot of reasons. Let me take this cover off real quick here and we can take a look at it and get a, a detail going. Okay, first and foremost, you're gonna see the, uh, uh, the color scheme. Okay, this is a, um, a, a hydrographic dip thing that's, uh, you know, coating that is basically uh, what we call a carbon fiber uh, look. It's beautiful. It's coated with a clear coat, so it's going to maintain its uh, integrity for a much longer time than without the clear coat. Uh, it gives a little bit of shininess to it, which is kind of neat because this is supposed to be a blingy gun, okay? Uh, so you'll notice that right away. There's that carbon fiber um, uh, finish. And let's see if I can get any more detail on the carbon fiber because sometimes uh, I don't want to miss anything. Really, there it is. I think I said carbon fiber hydrographic finish with gloss coat. I, I nailed it. <laughs> now, the other thing to notice is the big mouth magwell and the heavy base plate that we put in there it allows those magazines to drop out nice and heavy that's the silver version you can notice we've got a silver and red and uh, kind of a, uh, a carbon fiber theme going here well heavy base plate and silver big mouth magwell in um, in red the trigger itself is our pyramid trigger with a red and silver safety. I'm going to crack that and bring that safety out there so you can kind of get a look at that. You'll notice we've done our Glock knuckle cut, our trigger, trigger finger undercut. Glock knuckle allows you to get up a little higher on the gun. It helps eliminate the uh, wear and tear on your knuckle when you shoot a lot. Uh, the trigger undercut allows you to put your other hand, your off hand, right in the right spot when you shoot so you can just get the perfect grip. Really a, a nice piece. Uh, the um, other thing you're going to notice, of course, is the extended uh, controls on this side right here. Let me go and show you real quick. Uh, we've got our checkered magazine release button in red. Uh, this is the um, uh, extended slide stop. Uh, this is the Aero, I believe that's the Aerotech version. Yeah, that's what that is. And then this one right here is the extended precision slide lock, also known as the takedown lever. And that allows you to get a little bit of grip on that. Now, uh, we've also got our stainless steel pin kit in there. So it all matches up, kind of that silver and red concept again. Now on top, you're going to notice the satin chrome finish. And I like this a lot because it's not too shiny to the point of every time you touch it, you have fingerprints all over it. Now you will get some fingerprints on it, but it won't show as bad. The satin kind of eats up, you know, some of that uh, uh, fingerprinting. Uh, that said, um, it really is a nice look, especially for this gun. I really just thought, like the way it really looks. Uh, you'll notice too that we did a uh, color fill, which is a, uh, a Cerakote color fill on the, uh, the logo, which is always a nice look. Yeah, let's see if I can get to the color on that. There you go, that's a little bit better. There it is. And then out here is a little bit of custom engraving. And uh, the ladies know what that means. Okay, so I'll just leave it at that. Uh, on the uh, back side, uh, this is our charging handle. It's obviously in red. It helps you get a little better purchase on the grip of the, um, uh, of the, of the slide to be able to rack it. So you can rack it with one hand, you can rack it with two hands. It just makes it a little bit easier to manipulate. So you don't have to squeeze it and rack back. And finally, the last thing you're really going to notice, of course, is the Leopold red dot optic. Okay? It's really uh, the premier red dot op optic for many reasons. 
And you also notice we have a suppressor sight out there that sits tall. So we'll dial these in where the red dot sits right on top of the suppressor sight. So anytime you get that perfect alignment right there, you're going to be very happy. You won't see the red dot. You can see a little bit of red in there, but that just gets blown out by the camera. So there's really no way to get around that. There's the red dot right there kind of dancing around. It, it's obviously much smaller than that. The camera kind of blows it out for whatever reason. Uh, inside, we've got our tungsten guide rod. Helps reduce recoil significantly. Uh, we've got the barrel has uh, been um, uh, uh, redone and uh, just also finished in the chrome. So it really matches up nicely. Uh, you know, really, I, I'm just looking at this gun and it's just so beautiful, you, you almost hate to shoot it. <laughs> but the nice thing about shooting this particular gun is very easily clean too. Glocks are notoriously easy to clean, notoriously easy to maintain. Um, but this satin chrome finish is easy to clean. I mean, it, it kind of almost is like a Teflon in a sense that the, uh, a lot of the, uh, uh, the residues and the oils just kind of wipe off. You'll also notice if you, if you, you know, you, you really think about what we've done here, uh, we've got our pyramid cut, which reduces the slide weight significantly. And the pyramid cut is one of my favorites. I've actually got it on my gun and I really like it a lot. Uh, but it does, you know, look good, but it also, like I said, it, it reduces the weight of the slide and allows you to uh, basically shoot a gun that's not quite as heavy. And again, these are for three ladies, and we thought that was a really nice feature. So overall, this is a, just a dynamic gun. I mean, if you're looking to do some custom work, look at this one and say, well, I like this, I like that, or I want to do the whole thing. We'll make one, you know, basically just like you, uh, just like this for you. So the bottom line is, it's, you know, we're all about the custom guns. We've got... Uh, guns in here at any one time that are in play, but we've got literally hundreds of pictures on our website, uh, on our Instagram. Uh, we've got videos. I mean, I must have 50 or 60 videos on custom guns that you can get ideas from. Uh, the, the goal is to help you build a custom gun that's truly for you. So if you've got an, a good, a, an idea, you, you, want, you, you want some ideas, <laughs> either way, if you've got an idea, you go to our website, get some more ideas. If you want to talk to someone, talk through the build, give us a call. Bottom line is we're here to help you build a custom gun, get something that's truly unique and that not only looks good, but shoots better as well. I'm Lenny McGill. This is, of course, the Glock Store Performance and Custom Shop right here in San Diego, California. And I invite you to come down sometime because we do have custom guns in our shop that you can actually test drive. You can see what you like best about it. So I hope to see you here sometime. Thanks for watching. And I hope to see you next time.